Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Happy Tuesday. So when you see this video, it's going to be later on this evening, whenever YouTube is done processing or whatever. But today I'm going to bring to you the products. If I were to choose a product to use um, throughout the year, or for a season or two, because a lot of you, Sapphire, you, out of products, are you out of all the products that you have, out of all the categories, which one would you choose? You have to just choose one, and you can use that for a year or a season or two. You said a season or two, but I've chosen the products that I want to bring to you to show you if I can just choose just one out of all the products that I have out of each category, then I would use that, and I can get by with that too. It, it wouldn't. I can get by with that because me. Um, less means a lot to me. Little things are mean a lot to me. It don't have to be this extravagant, you know, hoopla. You know, little things mean a lot. Ask my husband or ask the people that I love, you know. Little things mean a whole lot to me. I believe that's why my husband said that he married me. That one of the reasons why he said he married me. Because he said, you know, you don't really, you're not into all of this, you know. And that's just me. It's just subtle. You know, but anyway, I'm going to show you the things that I would use for a year or a season or two. Okay, I'm going to start with the conditioners and then the, the um, protein. I have my oil and my moisturizer and I have the shampoos. Okay, because you asked me about a clarifying shampoo and then what shampoo would I use for to keep my hair moisturized or whatever. So we're going to start the video. Okay. The Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Moist, I would use this. This would be my deep conditioner. Okay, I would use this. I would also co-wash my hair with this as well. Okay, because I have co-washed my hair with this and it does beat the co-washing, but the co-washing really is a cleansing agent and it does clean my hair as well, just like this one does. But I would just use this. Okay, I chose this over the co-wash. The co-wash I've been using maybe five years. This one I've been using maybe 20 years. Not this, but just the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Moist. I mean, the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle not the mega moist, okay, just the, the original one. So this would be my deep conditioner. My protein, it would be this one. This one really brought my hair back with also me taking care of it and reading and figuring out what my hair likes and dislikes and how to use this because some people use this every two weeks. Um, I've been getting a lot of messaging. Some people use it every three weeks. Some people use it once a month, every other month, or every three months. Okay, and that's fine if you're stretching it because remember, this is a protein and you don't want to continue to use that because you don't know if you're protein sensitive. So you have to be careful. I would use it once a month or every other month or even stretch it for every three weeks, every three months. Okay, this one really brought my hair back. It really has. And I, I love this for this. Um, it conditioned my hair. It restored my hair. It, my hair was really unhealthy. I hate to say damage, but it was unhealthy, okay? And when I started using this, maybe four or five months, I noticed a, a, a an amazing um, difference in my hair. So that's why it's still in my hair. And if I, you know, when I, when I use products and I see a change for the better, I, I, I stick with those products. I really do. I, I don't listen to other people. I stick with those products, okay? The shampoo. My moisturizing shampoo, you guys already heard my testimony about this one. This is a bottle of silk to me. All of my hair strands seems like they're covered with just this amazing silk or satin. This is what this feels like. And when I rinse out really well, this stuff, it still feels like silk to me. And it keeps my hair soft and moisturized through the whole week, through the whole entire week. I like it. My clarifying shampoo, I spoke about this too. You guys already heard that testimony as well. Strength and Restore shampoo, it's a clarifying shampoo. It's stripping like a deep cleanse through my scalp and my hair. But when I use this, this stuff leaves my hair very moisturized and soft. I'm not lying. I, I wish y'all hair, I wish y'all hair strands was like mine and you'd use this, then you'll see what I'm talking about. This stuff is, is, is amazing to me for a clarifying shampoo. So, yeah, yeah. So now the oil that I would use for a year or a season or two, okay? And you probably think I'm going to pick that oil, but check this out. Bam! This right here, the Ahoba oil. Now, this oil is amazing to me. 
It feels like a moisturizer. Once I put it throughout my scalp and my hair, it feels like a moisturizer. Remember, oils are not. But this one on my hair, it feels like a moisturizer. It keeps my hair soft. It doesn't weigh my hair down, okay? And it keeps my hair together. I like this oil. And I would choose this one oil over the oils that I have. This oil right here, this oil, okay? Last but not least is my moisturizer. And that would be my avocado moisturizing hair milk for me all. I've been using this for a couple of years now. My girlfriend introduced this to me. Oh my goodness gracious. This moisture lasts in my hair for a whole entire week. Now, if you have a moisturizer and it's giving you moisture, you don't have to touch your hair up or your scalp or moisturizing seal for a whole week, you shouldn't buy anything thing else. You shouldn't buy anything else. You should stick with what you have, whether it's this or whether it's the olive oil or whatever, whatever else they got out there that's a moisturizer, you need to stick with that, okay? So this is my moisturizer. This is what I would use. Now, when I put this in my hair, it feels it felt like I put this in there, okay? Remember, oils are not, are not moisturizers. So it, it, this feels like this. That's why... I, would, I chose this over the coconut and the grapeseed and the, um, the uh, apricot. I chose, I chose this. I love it. I really do. The grease that I was using, guys, that um, grease that I have, um, that grease is really thickening my hair. I'm 14 weeks post. My hair is so doggone thick. My edges are thick, okay? My hair is growing, and uh, uh, lots of you had told me once you start using that grease, your hair gonna start growing, your hair gonna start thickening up. You were lying. You you was not lying. You was not lying. Okay. So yeah. So I hope and pray that you enjoyed this video, guys. Um, you're gonna see this video a little later. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna go downstairs and make this cornbread. I got some greens on. I got rosemary chicken. So I have to do now is just make the cornbread, and then after the cornbread is done, then we're gonna eat. Okay. So if it's the Lord's will, you guys will see me on Friday and I hope and pray that you guys enjoy the rest of the week. Thank you ever so kindly for watching. God bless you. Mm -hmm.